One woman, one coyote, hidden up the south side. Still no sign of them. Giant, they can be headed your direction. No sign from here. Drug dealers robbing drug dealers. On the ground! Down! Down! Get down! Cartel lookout. They must be protecting a drug run. Sniper kill the intercept. This is really weird. Shots keep going 200 yards up on the ridge. No one's moved, so stay down. Yeah, that's good advice, sir, Sheriff. Great. Can you see where that woman's gone? No, nothing. I know this is too obvious, but this is a real Mexican standoff. On it, Chief. It's a 
man. Holy Dinah. Heroin. Cocaine. Hey, this is strange, boss. Look. Yeah, there's weird things happening at the border. It's getting a lot weirder, boss. What the hell is that? Detonator. All right, I want pictures of everything here, especially that detonator. I got people in D.C. who want to see this. And burn those drugs. What about Homeland evidence? Do it! Come in. Sir. Is this everything they sent? Yes, you have all the photos they've sent you. And I'm going to need hard copies as well. Okay. What do you think? It's definitely a detonator. Probably some kind of dirty bomb. So an ISIS cell is trying to bring... An ISIS cell likely already in place in the U.S. and this is someone's plan to detonate a bomb with a radioactive cloud big enough to destroy a major city. Who sent this? Some old friends of mine. They call themselves Shadow Wolves. Don't go in there without backup. Shaw. Quiet. Where is he? Headed to Mexico. Uh! You 
days of killing are over. Get your team here now. Stick the girl with more of me. I've got a few more questions for her. I'm filing a protest. Yeah, so you see me on that. the hell do you want? Nice to see you too, Major. You know I was on leave in Majorca, up to my eyes in tequila shots and tits. And I've never heard that before. Come on. You missed me. Ever since we were stuck together for those freezing nights in that safe house in St. Petersburg. Only your fantasy. No proof. He's on the verge of something. Send someone else. She'll be at the old Fox in Tunbridge tonight. You got her involved. Don't be a presumptuous twit. She was the best choice, and she wanted the assignment. Are you sure you've had no contact with her? Well, ever since you ordered me to leave her, you know I haven't. This is top priority. And this time, let's try and minimize the damage, loss of life, etc. Shadow him. I don't trust him. Milton handed me intel on how you've infiltrated Khan's operation, and he's up to something nasty. Screw you. Ah, wait. You did. How many times I lost count? That's it. <laughs> After two years. You just disappear. I have no clue if you're dead. And now you show up here asking me about Khan. Yeah, nobody's heard from you in a long time either. We haven't got long. He's planning something big. Find Sissing her slabs. Look for anything on a project to call to home now. I haven't been able to. He's watching me too closely. Something's just snapped in him. And he's gotten way closer to ISIS leaders. No, just get out of here. You're gonna blow my cover. Wait. Shoot at me. What? I'm gonna run. You shoot at me. One more thing. Make sure you miss. <laughs> Sanchez, I can't choose. I just can. You choose for me, Sanchez. You are no fun. You used to be fun. Have some of this. It is exquisite. Each bottle is made out of 20 bushels of pears. Can you believe that, Sanchez? Huh? Mm. I want to go to France. I want to visit this vineyard. I want to buy this vineyard, Sanchez. You think they'll sell it to me? I know that face. 
I never liked that face on you, Sanchez. You have something bad to tell me, don't you? And I was so enjoying this cognac. Spit it out! We got hit last night. One of our runs across the border. Pinches cabrones! How many did we lose? One of our coyotes was killed. Who was it? Beltran? Hector? Not sure. No trace of them. They just burned our truck, and they burned our load. Wolves! Wolves. Come on out. <laughs> oh, Chucky. <laughs> How many times have I told you not to sneak up on Daddy like that? Good. Oh. <laughs> you know, you never were a good liar. Reward for your hard work. Kids, let's jug up. Horse, bring that over here. <coughs> Smells great. Yeah, what'd you make this time? Hola, linguine in que paz. Yeah, you're the only all-state quarterback I know who can cook like this. You're gonna make somebody a real nice wifey someday. Ooh. Well, yesterday was tough. A whole lot of killing, even for rival cartels. Board's getting worse every day. So did you hear from your sources in Washington about those Arabic notebooks? Well, now that you mention it, I did hear from them, and they're uh, sending us a new guy for the team. Why? They think we missed something? Like how it was in Indians? No. They want to assess the situation. You know, DC's in a frenzy about ISIS crossing the border. Because they already have. Yeah. Well, maybe. But we still have friends in Washington. And I just want to say that uh, the way you handled yourselves yesterday, I'm, I'm proud of you. You know, if we could just keep knucklehead and stay behind cover here. <laughs> Junior, is your cousin's uh, honor ceremony still this week? Uh, yeah. Kalen was up on his prosthetics this morning. Oh, oh that's yeah. awesome. Yeah. Well, you know, after four tours over there, he's my hero. He wants to join the organization here. 
Any objections? Mm -hmm. Of course not. Mm. Like I am. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I hated it over there. I mean, there's a bomb on every road. Hit Caleb when he didn't expect it. You always do. The whole region is a mess. Iraq, Iran, Afghanistan. Hey, we did our job. You really think the military cared about what we taught them over there? I mean, do you? What's the use in tracking the old ways when you got a drone? You can do the same thing. No, we were the ones that led them to specific terrorist units. And then what do they do? No questions. You just push a button from an office somewhere and bam. Explosion everywhere. Exactly. And then there's a few less terrorists to blow your cousin's legs off. We're their terrorists. We're the invaders in their eyes. Hey, what your cousin was doing is honorable. He was doing his duty, just like we're going to do our duty. Mm -hmm. We operate in secret, but our funding is secure. And it's like I always say. Oh, no. If a man farts alone, and then... No, no, no. You mean... A man who thinks his farts don't stink. No, no. It's if a man is in the forest and he farts. A man who farts in confidence is a man who has lost his sense, sense of smell. smell. <laughs> <laughs> like That's that. what it was. <laughs> it's so gross. Why would you break her arm on camera when you don't know who's watching? Except to make a shitstorm for me? One nuclear attack on our soil and all this political correctness evaporates. It's a stupid thing to do, and it makes things very difficult. You mean you're getting soft in the middle? All I do is bend the rules for you, and you're always pushing it. Yeah. And for years, your colleagues have been holding open a huge revolving door, shouting, come on in and attack us. Well, that's a bit of an oversimplification, but I do understand your frustration. Frustration. Now you're even using DC appeasing words. I'm sending you to do something. I'm not sure what it is, but it's out of the box. Nabahi. What the hell kind of a name is that? It's Navajo. We were in the first Gulf War together. Saw some shit. He runs a unit called the Shadow Wolves. Yeah, I've heard of them. Indian trackers catching bad guys the old-fashioned way. They're very good at it. I thought they were with the DEA. Drug trafficking didn't budget cut shut them down? This is a new covert unit. Nobody knows. Even Bortac? They work with Border Patrol Tactical, but there's a reason I fund them, and my friend's in charge. It's Nabahe. So you're funding covert Indians? They found the Syrian with the nuclear bomb parts. In Germany? Nabahe's expecting you. And you'll disavow them if something's revealed or uncovered, just like you would me. Plane's waiting. I'm sorry your man was killed in the desert by those damn wolves. I don't like this kind of news. Muhammad dying like that. Should we still move forward with your plan? We must go ahead. Immediately. No delays. I don't have time. I know this gap. Back to me. Lauren, please come in.
What is he doing here? He gives me the creeps. Me too. In fact, everyone. But that's why I keep him around. I've been worried about you. Who is the man who accosted you tonight? A footballer I used to see. You know I dated a few of them before you, right? Yes. Yes, you did. <laughs> but did you shoot guns at them? When they tried to abuse me. You must have played for Liverpool then. <laughs> I didn't know you carry. Oh, I just started. And may I see this gun? Sure. Omar doesn't like guns. He prefers other methods of defense. This evening is now officially past exhausting. I'm going to bed. You won't need this here. Especially with Omar around. Sure? Yep. Well, get in, Needle Dick. Let's go. Hang on to your shorts. Welcome to our high-tech TP. You built this all under the radar. Yeah, with the help of your boss, but you can't tell anybody. And Branson will scalp me before you can. <laughs> hey, everybody, listen up. Here's our newbie. You can look into me. Yeah, well, he doesn't either. Uh, he's part Japanese. His grandfather was stationed in Tokyo after the war. Yeah, we call him our native samurai. Omerito gozaimasu. My half-breed also, French mother. J'espère qu'elle est Catherine de Neuf. I bet he's from that one tribe. What's the famous tribe? Ooh, the, the wannabe tribe. tribe. Yeah. That's the one. 
So what, you got nothing? No, I didn't realize there was such a thing as a female shadow woman. Oh, they're the most ferocious kind, brother. And she's got claws. And her bite, it's worse than her bark. So, what are you gonna do? Are you gonna join us? Or are you gonna run? No, I'm not sure. I'll tell you what I will do is I'll learn from you because of a story I heard this morning. About him. About being in some godforsaken village in Iraq during the Gulf War. He held off wave after wave of Saddam's Republican Guard, saving his unit and my boss. Just native folklore. Not for my boss. My mother has some Cherokee in her, does that count? <laughs> <laughs> oh man, everybody got Cherokee in them. Even Johnny Depp. Oh, now there's a real Indian. He don't look like no Johnny Depp to me. When's your flight to Mexico? Milton's got me on 10 o'clock. She calls you jump. Don't we all? I have my two best agents tracking Khan. Yes, Lady Milton, I understand. It will take some time. That's right. I will be in touch, thank you. Well, your hunch to send Shaw to the border was right. But what are the odds of them actually finding Khan? Well, they're not good. ICE and Border Patrol do the best they can with limited resources, but their hands are tied. And Khan won't be the only one getting across. Thousands of Syrians crossed last year. Who knows how many of them are ISIS? But, sir, the vetting process. The vetting process is fake news. It's bullshit. Who knows how many could turn or have already turned? Sir? I'm worried about you. I understand what happened when your daughter was killed in Afghanistan. But I believe that you are operating from a position of revenge. And frankly, you are breaking so many rules that it not only alarms me, it... Go ahead and finish the thought. Sir, please listen to me. No, listen to me. Because I'm only going to say this once. You have no appreciation for the significance of the fight that we're in. The U.S. is making the same mistakes so many others have. Your generation doesn't read history, so you have no clue that we're reliving the appeasement mistakes of Wilson, of Chamberlain, and stumbling into our own siege of Vienna. That's right. Shake your head at me, because I don't know what I'm talking about. You don't read the Daily ISIS social media press briefings, beheadings of dozens on a beach, burning men and women alive in cages, and we're supposed to do nothing? 
And some chicken shit soldier that she was training, who she was helping to lead a better life, he turns his gun on her and sprays her in the face with bullets and says, God is great. Sir, I'm sorry. Get out. So you're just gonna roam the streets of Mexico knocking on drug dealers' doors? Something like that. <laughs> Go! Has to be one of the things I missed about you most. No fear. You're wrong. I've got plenty of fear, but I got one code. I know. Embrace it. Wait, I have something for you. Try this. Stilton. Made just down the road from me, Mum. So, what's got Carm on to sneak a dirty bomb into the US? Well, he's been financing terrorist attacks for years. And you know this because Milton has you following the money? I never knew my LSE degree would take me to such heights. Huh. I used to be closer to him, but I'm just eye candy now. We haven't slept together for months. And there's something really wrong with him. Some kind of sickness. He won't tell me a thing. And you think that's what's driving him now? Into doing something with ISIS on the US border? Maybe. A last chance to avenge his family. They come from Afghanistan. Well, I should say they came. The US military annihilated most of them. Tracked him to his family's village. Called in drones. Everyone wiped out. His nieces, nephews, cousins. But he wasn't even there. We've become high-tech savages. All the coyote trails, sir. You got a call from Branson? Hey, Cheyenne, set him up at your desk. Hello? So your name's Cheyenne, but you're Navajo. Yeah. And that's Ray Nero. He's not even Italian. What are you talking to me? What, are you talking to me? No, you talking to me? Are you talking to uh, me? Stop hey. naming the only great Nero. <laughs> huh? It's a good looking guy, is that your boyfriend? That's the monster slayer. The Navajo spirit. The slayer of strange gods. Sounds like my job description. <laughs> well, now you're screwed. Can't say I haven't heard that before. No, I'm serious. He will come for you. And when he does, you won't escape. Is that one of your people's legends? What people? Who are you talking about? The ones with the beads? And the rugs. Those people? You know what I meant. No, I don't know what you meant. Why don't you tell me? Mm. 
What the hell have you gotten me into? What is it? I asked Nabahe what was going on. He told me that the feathers of a bird protect it from the frosts of the winter. Yeah, that's one of his favorites. He seems to have a lot of them. The intel I just passed to him is from a reliable British source. The Menendez cartel outside Monterey are aiding ISIS camps near the Mexican border. Nabahe's going to have you cover the trails that he knows their coyotes use. Yeah, well, I'm going out with him tonight. Shaw, just find me something tangible. Signal or reliable human intel. I can't get a dime out of anyone here, especially for something covert, unless I have something concrete. Yeah, well, maybe a lone warrior can do more damage than an entire army in unfamiliar territory. I haven't heard that one. From a Cracker Jack box. I was ten. It spoke to me. Just go. So, my boss is out of town. I'm running this place. This way. Oh, if only I had my rifle, you little rat bastard. <laughs> this is a lot of money. Yes, it is. But you are a tricky one. So, what's stopping me from killing you and keeping all these, eh? I just had her killed for betraying me. I think you would be foolish to make me your enemy. You don't look like a fool. No. I also need you to watch out for this Brit. How you say it? Thug. When do you want to leave? Tomorrow night. And your men are meeting you there? I let them know when. I don't want any surprises like last time. That won't happen. But those wolves, I can't guarantee. Don't worry about them. I have plans for them. Uh. Oh, don't mess with her. She's a mean one, eh? Assassin. <laughs> You know you need to quiet your soul. You really become one with nature out here, huh? <laughs> uh, they see a lot of weird things out here. Make you city people run back to your condos and your shopping malls. What's the strangest thing you've ever seen out here? Well, beside you? Ago, we were uh, looking at a path up there, just over that ridge. And saw this little red light, this little red dot. A laser? No, it's just a red dot, and it went zzzz over here about 200 yards. And then this smell, this stench, rotten. And uh, then this uh, laugh. Weird cackle. I don't know what it was. And out of nowhere. <laughs> I got you pretty good, didn't I? Uh huh. Very funny. What about the smell? Well, that part's true. Sometimes we can catch people just because you can smell them, sometimes half a mile away. You smell something now? Yeah, you've been eating too many burritos. Stay away from the beans, will you? The worst smell is fear. You can smell guilt, too. It comes out of your pores.
up the path over there. Coyote's leading, looks like four people. Go find horse and shine in. Find him. Out here, coyotes can disappear just like that. Get over there. No, Dios mío! <laughs> What'll happen to the girl? Probably gonna sell her to the sex trade. The coyote's gonna make his money one way or another. until Cheyenne called to you. Come on, I got a place for you to bunk. Well? No. Why can't we just call in Homeland? Have drones search the desert Because border. they won't do anything. They'll listen in on innocent people's phone calls. They'll read every goddamn email, but ask them for surveillance on the border, and it's, oh, no, we can't do that. But I have a connection at Homeland, and he owes me a favor. What are you going to tell them? Oh, I know something bad is going to happen. Alex, they didn't listen to the Saudis when they told them about the Chechen bomber blowing up the Boston Marathon, but they'll listen to you. Excuse me. Close the door. Just in time. Four. I'm getting nowhere here. Your agent is the best chance we have. I need you to push him. Did he what, exactly? We need to find Khan. I'll see what I can do.
What's the latest on McLaren? He verified Khan's in Mexico. You should head there now. Before he just charges in again? Unfortunately, it's what makes him so effective and destructive. Like all the men I know. <laughs> the first woman to lead this place was called the housewife spy. She went through hell. Trying to contain Dante's nine degrees. Hmm. Yep. Yeah. I keep him there to remind myself that we're dealing with the same hell. Just different devils. White House. I need to speak to Ryan Blake. Alex, what's up? Branson is up to something with MI6. Come over now. Are you real? Are you? That's a good question. Chucky, leave him alone. You slept in my room. Yeah. Want to see a magic trick? Okay. Charlie, you hear me? I did. Go ahead. Damn pancakes, we gotta go. Come on, you're not escaping. Hi. Hi, guys. So, this is Junior's aunt, Callum's mom. You must be very proud. And this is their grandfather. his brother. He's a decorated war hero. SEAL Team 6? Mm -hmm. They haven't spoken in many years. Yeah, something, something really bad happened between them and they just don't. Natani? <laughs> That's the way you white people would say it. Natani. It means leader. fought to save our land. I'm proud of you, son. I want you to join the team. Salute!
What? You didn't think I knew you were coming? You've got some serious issues. Yeah, tell me about it. You already just told us. The Khan has two ISIS cells already here in the U.S., and they've been waiting for him for months. And I told you, I will not stand for these kinds of interrogations. Alex, there isn't time. We don't have the luxury to make him our friend and help him see the error of his ways. And what if he just lied to you, just to get you to stop? And you want to take that chance? That if he's telling the truth, we miss the opportunity to stop an attack? Nobody's going to care how we got the information if we can stop this. It's not a fair fight. You don't get it. It's that simple. Everything's got to me. You do see the irony. What? Your people. The ones with the beads. But also the ones that have a long-standing history of serving this country's military. The very army that ran them off their lands, slaughtering and scattering them from one hellhole of a reservation to the next. Nabahi has a saying. You mean all is connected? <laughs> yeah, that one. But he has another one. Each generation sacrifices for the next. The connection is the sacrifice. him in that burnt factory in Juarez with some of his kind. And another thing, not a word to anyone, eh? Hey, the boss can never know. Stinky ass from here, Amigo. Dirt bike's on the trailer. You know where he is? Oh, they know one thing for sure. Junior, got my mic? The boss is always good at getting intel. Mic system's up and it's ready. It's abandoned factory, not far away. Junior, best. Oh, war attack, border patrol. Take the 45 in the case. Not yet. Guns are loaded. Listen, I'm not gonna risk getting crap for some Brit's hunch. I got a vestry shot. Come on, let's go. Just been baptized with Sanchez's piss, my friend. That's nothing. Drank my own piss in the Iraqi desert for two weeks to stay alive. That is disgusting. But you are um, a young, strapping, tough boy, huh? No. Just British. Thanks for getting dressed up for me. You're welcome. 
In fact, I have you to thank, because I am hosting a fundraiser for the families of dead English spies. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want coming here to my country? Listen, I don't care about you selling drugs to stupid American kids, but you do understand you're making deals with ISIS bastards who are going to blow up those same customers, smuggling nasty terrorists across the border just to destroy your markets. I mean, how stupid are you? What the hell is he talking about? Mierda, jefe, eh? He's delirious. Sanchez. And I thought Parliament was devious. I'd watch your back if I was you, amigo. Nonsense, Jefe! I cut his head off hey, and hey, sent hey, it to us! Hey, 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 hey. Dead customers don't pay my bills. And since you like it so much, we will provide some more piss for your lunch. <sighs> Just give us one of your Coronas. Tastes about the same. <laughs> Wow. You are a... How do you English say? You are a... A cheeky fellow. But your head will make a good football for our Saturday game. Get him out of here! Now! Take him to the warehouse! Anything? There's nothing. Oh. Man, I hate this part. We're waiting. We're waiting for what? They're in there. They're sitting ducks. Junior, anything? Nada. A bad tip? Well, sometimes you just gotta wait. See when you're hunting rattlesnakes. See where they bite you first. <laughs> now, what the hell are you doing here? She's got you following me, hasn't she? We got about a minute until they get here. Maybe less.
Get McLaren, let's get out of here. to lose you, Major. Not yet, at least. Plus, I have a situation that means your particular expertise. I know they're in there! I know they're in there. I can feel it. Sit still, Ray. But they're in there, and we need to get them now. I think something moved. The far west end. Somebody's down there. Yeah, they're in there. I know they are. We gotta take these guys now. You don't know that, Ray. Just hold still. Hold still? Are you kidding me? What are we waiting for here? Just tell Ray to stay calm. Nothing's moved. Wait, look! Northwest corner. I see him. They're there. Yeah, damn right they're in there. Ray! What the hell are you doing? Ray, you're gonna get a hell of a beating when this is over. All right, hit it. Hey! Ray, get back in here! Damn it, Ray, I said stand down. Cover that fool's ass. You trying to get yourself killed? No, I'm going south. Now watch my shit! Do I follow him? Yeah, follow him. Shit. Ray, don't go out there! He's about down there.
taking fire! SOB, son. Can you make it to the van? So where is he? Ah, the one I shot wasn't Khan. Ray. He's gone. I couldn't bring him back. <laughs> Ray. You damn fool. Junior, get Homeland on the phone. I have 12 missed calls from your wife. Uh, no messages, just all these calls. What? What's going on? He's got Chucky. What, what, are you, what are you talking about? I do have Chucky. I also have your wife. I forgot to mention that. If you harm them, I'll do what? Call a drone? Kill all of us? Like you did? My family? I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Tell your wolves. And you murderous NSA sidekick. That if they make a single call, I'll blow your wife's head off. In front of Chucky.
I mean it. I'm watching you with my cameras. What have you done? Death comes that quick. Summon fire from the heavens. Generations wiped out. Slaughtered innocent children. Blow the heads off of grandfathers. Have you killed them? And you ran away! You and your little wolves. So brave. Running back here to your sacred lands. You thought you were safe. No. Brave warrior. Your pain will not be over so quick. Goodbye, do what he said. Please. You can have me. Just let them go. I never got to make such an offer. Early morning, a village sleeps. Not bothering the great American Empire. Then the button is pushed. Rocks crush the head of my mother. The very cheeks I kissed each night. You do not think I would have begged for what you do now? Me for them! Me for them! Nubai! Hey! Hey! Nubai! You gotta keep your head. He hasn't killed him yet. He's just buying time. We gotta call Homeland! No! He will kill him! He's gonna kill a whole lot more! Is there a tribe's casino? Yeah. And we gotta find this trailer now. Who knows what he's got planned? You're not gonna get my wife and daughter killed. Okay. No. What? What do you want me to do? Meet me at your sacred hill. Your ancestors can watch you die there. I'll be there. Junior, get horse to a hospital. Evacuating the casino now. Good. There it is. Come. Your wife is this way. Wait, 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 wait. It's rigged. Okay. Someone's in there. Hey! Hey, can you hear me? There's a vent. Hey, can you hear me? I can't see anything. Uh, here. Chucky? Chucky? Chucky, are you okay? Chucky, are you hurt? 
All right, you just sit tight, all right? We're gonna get you out of here. Just hang on. It's a bomb. All right, hang on, Chucky. Hold on a second there. Shoot me and your casino blows up. Everybody will be dead at their decadent rave. No, brave warrior. No white man weapons can save you now. I found these at your home. So, choose your weapon. And yes, after I kill you, I will burn her alive. Oh no! I'm gonna be right back, okay? Come on, just sit tight. Listen, you don't have to do this. Why don't you just kill me and let her go? It's not going to be that easy. I will kill your whole tribe like you did mine. I can't reach it. Can we shoot it? No, it'll blow. Call Homeland. You are not going to get away with this. I'm going to die anyway. Ten minutes at least. Ten minutes? We've got less than six. There is nothing noble about this death. But you... You could still die with honor. If you can take this away from me. Chucky? Hey. Okay. This is gonna be just like one of your magic tricks, okay? <laughs> Sit still, right there. Yeah. I'm gonna try to freeze the wire. U.S. Army. They came to civilize us, to make us in their own image, just like they did your people. There's less than three minutes. I'm gonna shoot. No. One last try. Okay, Chucky. Chucky, I need you to help me. All right? This is gonna be like your best magic trick ever, okay? I need you to take this can. Take the can, come on. Take the can. I need you to spray it backwards on those wires, okay? Chucky, you can do this. Do it for your mom and your dad, okay? You can do it. What's she doing? Oh no. What's going on? I don't know. Let me see. Did you think I had only one way to set my bomb off? She's just us. Uh, Chucky! Now, you can watch death come to your people. What's going on, Chucky? What's going on?
Yeah. Nabahe. Nabahe. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah. It's tricky. She's alive. She stopped the bomb. Where are you? Where's Khan? Let me, let, me, I, uh, let me talk to her, please. Yeah. Here, honey. Daddy, I'm okay. <laughs> it, it's just a couple rope burns. <laughs> Thank God. I, I got your mom here. She's okay, too. The Bahe, Chucky was so brave. She froze the ropes to free herself. That's my girl. And Khan? He can't talk to you right now. He's got a tomahawk in his chest. <laughs> Nabahe, you hang in there. The ambulance is on the way. Let me say goodbye to Chuck. His death comes to us all. Always out of season. I beat the slayers, huh? You will too. Chucky, please. Hush, little baby, now don't you cry. Daddy's gonna buy you a butterfly. If that butterfly can't sing, Daddy's going to buy you a dime. A dime. time? It's always a bad time. I've got a situation. I need you flying out tonight. Okay. But I'm bringing the wolves. Good call. <laughs> 